Okay, so before I get started with the stream properly, um, I would like to say that uh, things could be going better uh, for the people of Ukraine. So, in the about section on my Twitch page and also in the description of this video, assuming you're watching it on YouTube, there will be links in the description that will take you to one or two articles, both of which list various charities sending aid to Ukrainians in need. If you have any spare cash, please consider donating to one or more of the charities listed in either article. People could really use the help. With all that said, I can't think of anything else I want to say on the subject, so I will go back to doing what I do better than talking about serious topics like war, and that's trying to be a distraction from it all. Alright, what's up everybody? It's CS Nazo, and welcome back to the... Oh, I'm sorry. Let me start that over again. What's up everybody? It's CS Nazo, and welcome back to Let's Replay Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. In the last part, we... Let me check my notes. Um... We beat Gonzap. Um, let's see here. Uh, we purified the Shadow Togepi and gave it back in favor of an Ella kid. Uh, we beat uh, the pre gym. Uh, we made it into the Cypher Key Lair. And um, we then came here to Pyrite Coliseum, I think it was. To uh, capture a Shadow Lunatone. And in this part, well, we're going back to Cypher's Key Lair. We're going back to the Shadow Pokemon Factory. My apologies for starting the stream so late. I wasn't expecting that trip to the bathroom to last so long. How am I doing on Pokeballs? Real fast while I'm here. Uh, probably could be doing better. How much money do I have? Oh, I got some cash. Though, considering how much Pokeballs cost, probably not that much. Well, Ultra Balls, anyway. Let's stop by the outskirts stand. Really? Actually, hold on. Let's get, like, five of these. Oh, I have no more timer balls. I need more timer balls. Now we're going to go to Fennec. We're going to get some uh, Pokeballs and we're going to get some Great Balls. Because apparently he doesn't sell those here. Also, I'm going to organize my inventory real fast. Let's see here. Oh, I have a red candy. I should put those in the PC. I'm not going to use them for anything. Thank you. 
Let's give the rare candy to Flare. Sorry about that. These guys are still out. Purple. Pretty polluted as fuck. Oh, wrong way. I think I got everything on this floor. I don't think there's anything left to do on this floor, so it's just walking around. Hold on, let me let me put in the time code. Revive! Okay. That'll come in handy for a boss fight in which I can't win without spamming items. Which is something sad that I've noticed about myself recently with Pokemon games that... Fights I used to be able to win, I just can't anymore. Don't remind me. I'm, I'm sad, okay? Oh, hey there. You've got to be good to get this far. Be drill and first. Did I ever put that Lunatone in a purified chamber? Whoop, oh, shut up, Pokemon. Sorry. Shadow. Okay. So let's try and keep the bee drill alive. Uh, bug, right? Yeah, it should be bug. Fire. Flying. Rock? Yes, rock. So nothing we got on us right now. Actually, it is part poison. Ah, uh, Shadow Ball for now. Let's see how much this does to the current. Became the center of attention. Okay. That's not ideal considering Shadow Ball is ghost type and that doesn't do anything to normal type Pokemon. But, I mean, you were going to be targeted by Magic Leaf anyway, so. Excuse me. Wanna try that again? He does! He does wanna try that again.
I probably shouldn't have bothered with Psychic on uh, Duskull now that I'm thinking about it. I don't know what I was thinking. Because I'm probably going to wind up doing with Duskull what I did with uh, Umbreon, considering uh, um, they're both very defensive Pokemon. Ah, I just realized. Fuck, okay. Psychic on... Hold on. Confuse Ray on Togetic. And then Magical Leaf on Beedrill. Oh, almost. Didn't do much of anything, but okay. There goes Waluigi. Sorry, Waluigi. We'll heal you up. Flare. Come on out. Psychic on... Actually, no. Shadow Ball on Beedrill. And we're going to go with Flamethrower on Tokotik. Burned and confused. Okay, that's doing some decent damage. Not great damage, but decent. Oh, damn it. Oh, Shadow Pidgeotto. Okay, this is very interesting. Uh, Shadow Ball on Beedrill, and we're gonna go with a Bite on the Pidgeotto. We don't want to take out the Pidgeotto, we just want to try and weaken it. Woo! I think that was a crit. And I chose Bite specifically <laughs> to avoid making it faint. Well, nothing we can do about it. We, we might be able to catch one of them, though. Ah, uh, no, let's go with the Great Ball. I'm, I'm trying to think through what I know my Pokemon know in terms of moves. Do any of them know something that can put a Pokemon to sleep? Not to side as if I were a pylon. 
Pidgeotto fled somewhere. Unfortunate. Two Hyper Potions, all right. Something on the desk there, what's over here? Absolutely nothing, but I get the feeling. Nothing happened, okay, that's, oh, there you are. You get on my nerves the way you scurry around. Absol and Smeargle. Okay, no Shadow Pokemon yet. Uh, Duskull is not in a good space here. Uh, choice? Okay, this makes more sense now. No, it still doesn't make any sense. I was sure you were going to target Duskull with that. I mean, two two bites, fair enough. Uh, okay, own tempo prevents confusion. All right. Uh, does own tempo affect? Uh, uh, I'm trying to think. Does that affect um, sleep? Does that sleep? Confused. No, it's just confusion. We're good. That skull fell for the taunt. Not good. There you go! Can't use Confuse Ray out to the top. All right. Again, unfortunate. We'll figure out a way to make it work. Fan. Oh, Smeargle woke up, and it's Scratch! It's using Scratch! For us. Almost with the Dawn Fan. Fury attack!
I was about to say. Flamethrower on the Ampharos, Magical Leaf on the Donphan. Giga Drain! Okay, hold on. We might be able to make that work. Uh, let's get favor, uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Wait, Giga Drain's only 60 power? What? I mean, I guess if we need some healing, it'll work. No, no, no. We're just gonna, we're just gonna keep what we got. I, I thought Giga Drain was way stronger than that, though. No, not a Shadow Tentacle. Okay, there it is. I was about to say, is Roselli a Gen 2 Pokemon? Because I couldn't find it on Serapy with all the other Gen 3s. Oh no, it's using rap in generation three. Oh, I so don't like you. Right, now we actually have to go back and heal again. charge Mr. Gorgon is on the top floor of this factory. Are you an acquaintance of Mr. Gorgon? Uh, sure. Oh, busy, busy, busy. I have to put in overtime every day. Unbelievable. It's terrible for my complexion. One HP up. Hi there. Nobody called for me, but here I am. Ta-da! I just imagine him doing jazz hands. Second he lands. Oh, I forgot to put Waluigi deeper in the party. Whatever. See, what I can do is I can hit the Kecleon with a Psychic. And then I can hit it with a Shadow Ball. 
And then I can hit it with a pursuit. Oh boy. There goes Duskull's defense. Actually, I just realized I could have just used Shadow Ball again. Whatever. Mighty Anna! Okay, for a second I thought the cutscene for the Shadow Pokemon was going to start. Oh, it missed. I was about to say, like, wait, <laughs> it just used Intimidate. You use Aerial Ace on the Duskull and not the Rosalia that's, like, still over half health? What? What are you guys doing? Those are the wrong targets for those moves. You could have taken both of my Pokemon out this fucking turn. Hop would be disappointed. Not hitting yourself. There you go. Hit yourself. That's not hitting yourself.
Ah, almost. Nothing from the Mighty Anna, though. Hit yourself! There you go. back so we can heal again. No, no, you're not allowed to go any farther. I forgot to... Uh, I gotta move my party around again. I keep forgetting to do that. Nine tails and jump one. We're actually gonna switch to Fluffy. We're gonna switch out to Fluffy. Uh oh. If that's who I think it's on. Okay. Alright, we really saw its conditions, which sucks, but alright. Yeah, that didn't do a lot. So we'll just have to deal. Okay, so it's just status conditions that are protected by safeguard. Oh boy. I was worried about that for some reason, I don't know why. Excuse me. I just take out the jump fluff. Fluffy grew to level 33! Tangala! 
Ooh, Shadow Tangoa! Shadow Rage. Oh, is that a more powerful Shadow Wave? Shadow Rage, Shadow Wave. No paralysis, unfortunately. Plans to try and paralyze with body slam. Didn't work there. Not quite with Fluffy. Ow. Safeguard is faded. HC down goes Fluffy. Waluigi, come on. Pursuit on Tangela, Magical Leap on Azumarill. There goes Duskull. Unfortunate, but manageable. And Jolteon. We should grew to level 34! Oh, Shadow Butterfree. Sand attack on the Butterfree. And... Grass Whistle on the Tangela. Basically the idea is that we're gonna do everything we can to avoid that Butterfree being able to attack. And then we're going to uh, focus on the Tangela. I mean, that's fine. Oh wait, yeah, Shadow Mist, evasiveness fell, duh. I'm an idiot.
Yeah, so its accuracy being lower doesn't really matter if our evasiveness keeps going down. Really, I can't tell. Let's go with quick attack, just to be safe. And then magical leap. Okay, maybe I can afford a bite. Oh yeah, I can definitely afford a bite. Alright, a magical leaf should bring it under. Another magical leaf, just in case. Not supposed to win. Okay, for a second I thought someone was evolving. I'm like, wait, what? Yeah, that was good. <clears throat> We're not going to go up the stairs just yet. Hello there. We achieved a technological breakthrough for transforming Pokemon into sh uh, many Pokemon into Shadow Pokemon at the same time. Unlike the old slow way, that's how we managed to deal with all the po uh, all the Pokemon from the SS Libra in, sh uh, in this short time. We can keep doing it too. If anyone tries to meddle with our fantastic plan, this is what happens. Cipher R and D Hospital, Ariados and Giraffe.
What? Oh, right! It's part normal! Fuck! Yellow crew to level 33! Swift. Okay, that could come in handy. Another move that uh, that can't miss. We're not going to use Defense Curl. Yeah, another move that can't miss. Great if we run into another Double Team Scout. Wild Plume, Zash out Pokemon? No. Alright. Hit that vile plume with a confused ray just to be on the safe side. Stantler! yourself? No. Same strategy as before! And yellow still flinches. Alright yellow, I need you to not flinch, okay? So what's the reasoning why Stantler can learn Shockwave? That didn't do a whole lot. Good job, Vileplume. Oh, it affects both of them. Still, didn't do a lot of anything to either one of them. Down goes the Vileplume. Bramble! They're both normal type Pokemon, so I can't use Shadow Ball.
Oh, hangs in there with one HP. But you flinch. We're gonna try this again. Let's go through to level 34! Curse! Uh, no, actually. Yes. Fuse Ray still works. Okay, so it's only damage dealing normal type moves that normal types are. They're immune to damage from the ghost. But we can still hit him with Confuse Ray and it'll still work. Water Pulse. Someone's going down this turn. Or not! Surprising! Bum bum! God, Zooks! The majority of the Shao Pokemon we made here have already been transported out. I've uh, I've also heard that the Sha uh, the Cipher HQ has completed final tuning of XE001, the ultimate Shadow Pokemon. Looks like you got here just a little bit late. Ahaha! <laughs> well, that sucks. What? Oh, there's another one. I wasn't expecting that. So it's you, is it? The one who's been causing a 14% loss in manufacturing productivity? Ah! You're the kid that dropped in on us at the SS Libra? I see now. You know far too much too much more about Cypher than you need to know. If nothing's done about you, there's a 98% likelihood that this factory in the Shadow Pokemon plan will be endangered. In that event, the danger to Cypher goes up a whopping 54%. That's critically bad news. I'm laughing because I'm having a hard time reading it out loud. I suppose we'll have to coax you into giving up the chase right here. I wasn't expecting there to be another battle between him and that table. We've got a bit of a problem here. I didn't heal. Uh, let me see here. Alright. Assuming Duskull gets to live, Shadow Ball should be enough to deal with the Shed Ninja. Okay. Duskull actually gets first turn. Shed Ninja goes down. Does that Wobbuffet do... Oh, it does Destiny Bond, which is not good. Uh... Let's do that. Duskull's gonna go down in, like... Okay. <laughs> 
Um, let's go with no flare. Wob effect goes down. Whoop. Just this magneton left. So we're gonna switch out to Waluigi. So we can put this thing to sleep. While we have uh, Flare deal some damage. Hopefully make it flinch so it doesn't attack. That didn't work. The Shadow Sky isn't too, too bad. Try this again. Excuse me. There we go. Missed again. Keep using grass whistle until it hits. Calculations are all out of whack. We're gonna have a lot of shadow Pokemon. A system lever. We're gonna have a lot of shadow Pokemon that need purified. Honestly, we could go to a PC and just put them in the purified chamber like right now. But that's a bit out of the way. So, not quite yet. see here.
Okay, I th for some reason I thought there might be something else down there. Hi! Hmm, I'm impressed that you got here. I'll we'll have to make you feel welcome. The Choke and Golem. Not exactly the best team to be going up against with <laughs> Jilteon and Flair. Uh, Thunderbolt on the Machoke. Oh, we switch out Flair for <laughs> Fluffy. Fortress! Mantai! Shadow Crobat? Nope. Wait, why do you use Ice Beam? Fluffy's still hanging in there. Bum bum! Some welcoming party this is! It turned into a going away party. Up. Oh. Oh. Okay. Let me actually put that down real fast. One oh six D Ball Shadow. All right, so now we're going to be heading out to the uh, to the lab. So we can put the finishing touches on those 
purifications, and also put new Pokemon into the purified chamber. Did I heal my Pokemon? I did not. Whatever. Uh, while I'm here... Wait a minute, hold on. Go here... You need to go here. There we go. Hold on. One more thing, actually. There we go. Just for my OCD. Shelter opened the door to its heart! Shelter regained the move takedown! Shelter regained the move refresh! Shelter obtained a ribbon. Nope. Yep. Growlithe opened the door to its heart! Growlithe were getting the move Flamethrower! Growlithe were getting the move Charm! Growlithe obtained a ribbon. Nope. We're gonna go back in, we're gonna put some more Pokemon in here. Miracle Seed, hold on. I'll take that Miracle Seed.
Alright, we're not gonna go back to the lab right away. But there is something I wanna check real fast. Nothing. Okay. Actually, while I'm here... Give that to Waluigi. Because we have another Pokémon that's gonna be ready for purification really soon. So right now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go back to Michael's bedroom and we're just gonna heal real fast. And then by the time we take the long way back, they should be uh, ready to be purified. Mirror Radar! Where is he? Real Gom Tower. We can't go after him. We're not ready. We're not ready to face him in Real Gom Tower. Okay, it looks like I was wrong, so we're just gonna run around this desk for a little bit. How close is that? Okay, like, very, really damn close. I'm just gonna run around this desk a little bit. If I run outside a little bit? There it is! Don't open the door to its heart. Lunaton regain the move Psychic. Lunaton regain the move Baton Pass. Lunaton regain the move Rain Dance. Lunaton attained a ribbon. Nope. Oh, there was a healing machine right right there, and I didn't even notice. Oh well.
Let's see what else is over here. We won't talk to you just yet. I want to see if there are no items around here. Interesting. Alright, I'm going to need you to move. Above here is the factory's all-important control machine. I can't let you pass, even if it takes inches off my chest. Golduck and Hitmontop. Very clear to me that Flare is not welcome out here. Oh, fun. There's paralysis. I think at this point I am going to try Ice Beam just kind of because. Water pulse on the Hariyama. Oh shit! They both flinched? Down goes the gold deck. This guy has two. This guy has two shadow Pokemon. thought that would be super effective and I was wrong.
Fantastic. Oh, fantastic! Oh, come on! I wanted Waluigi to stay alive because we're gonna need what we were gonna need Waluigi to help catch the Venomoth. Oh my God. No more of that! Weeping Bell. Shadow Weeping Bell? Yep. Of course. We may have to use a revive. We're, yeah, we're gonna have to use a revive at some point. We're not going to use the Max Revive, but we are going to use a Revive. Waluigi. Hit yourself! I should have tried using a Confuse Ray on the, uh... On the Weeping Bell. That's why. We only have the one revive. We're gonna lose. Are we gonna lose this battle? Jesus Christ. have to let some of these Pokemon thing. At least one of them. Shit. Of course you miss! Why wouldn't you miss? <sighs> Alright. No choice. No choice. No choice. Unless we want to lose this battle. No choice. We have to max revive. I fucking hate- you know what? No, we're not- No, I'll just take the loss. I'll just take the loss. But! I'll see if I can't take one of these Pokemon with me.
Yeah, I'm losing to a normal fucking trainer! What the fuck is wrong with me? What is wrong with... Like, I want to be mad at the game, but I can't. What is wrong with... It's me! I'm the problem here! How much money did I lose from that? Okay, it doesn't look like I lost any money. So the only thing that's hurt is my pride. Whatever. I genuinely feel like a piece of shit right now. Okay, let's see here. Start out with a gall duck. Start out with a gall duck and I hit him on top. Because yeah, I could have used the max revive on Hound Doom and won the battle. But at the same time, it's like... A part of me was just like, it. it's better to just lose this fight, save the Max Revive for later, and also not have to say that I had to use a Max Revive on a normal fucking trainer battle in order to win. But still... I fucking lost, that funny. God. No mercy this time! No fucking mercy. Okay! He just got it back!
So, I accomplished nothing that last fight. Fantastic. Okay, um... Send out Flare for right now. Flare can make quick work of both of them in an emergency. Go. Really? Not the emergency situation. You know, I don't even remember that guy from my last playthrough. So I probably beat him my first try and it was like no problem. You know, hold on. I don't have it yet. Okay. See what's over here first. TM26. What does that teach? T 
teaches Earthquake. Okay, so this is the only ground type TM in the entire game, and it's also going to be effectively, from what I understand, basically the only, uh, the only ground type move that uh, Sandrew can learn that does damage. I mean, Sand Slash. I mean, Yellow. I'm sorry. Okay, let's see if I'm right about that. Yeah, I'm totally right about that. There is technically Sand Tomb, but that's not going to work. <laughs> uh. So yeah, if I want him to have a ground type move, it's either Earthquake or nothing, which sucks because none of my Pokemon, except maybe... No, not even... Not even Duskull. So that's something I'm going to have to think about for a bit. Let me take a look at something real fast. Oh wait, Duskull has Levitate. But what it evolves into does not have Levitate, which is a problem. Really? Actually, it's very likely that that's correct. Fuck. Really? Oh, no. In that case, I'm going to have to think of an entirely new strategy. Okay, so what I was planning on doing was teaching... Um, Duskull Toxic. Uh, and basically do the uh, Confuse Ray Toxic strategy that Umbreon did. But in this game, you don't get the Toxic TM until... Um, until post-game. Which means we have a problem. I'm taking a look to try and see what else I got that could maybe work. But there's really nothing. I'll have to think of something. Okay, now all there is to do is adjust the voltage. Let me see. Where is the system lever? Huh? Whoops, I left it on my desk. That's not smart. Oh, hey, that's my system lever. You went and got it for me. Thank you. Wait, who are you anyway? You don't belong here. Darn, if the voltage goes up even a little, the computer controlling this whole facility will shut down. And oh my gosh, if that were to happen, the Shadow Pokemon production software could be destroyed. I can't let you lay one finger on this control machine. I feel like the Akron. I feel like literally the guy just on the floor below us is named Akron. Alright, what we got? Grumpig and Cedra. Fight on the Grumpig. And we're just gonna fucking ice beam the Cedra.
Glare grew to level 34. Fluffy grew to level 34. Ah, lovely. Actually, hold on. I just saw something. Two item. Attack miss, lovely. What I was thinking was that maybe there's a hell item that we could use that could inflict uh, poison if put alongside another move, but no. Uh, let's see. Shadow Ball on the Sea King, Water Pulse on the Pillow Swine. Water Pulse! Right, okay. Bum, bum. You can't have it! Give back the system lever! Okay, I'm gonna go heal. Cause something happens once you use the uh, the system lever.
Raise the voltage. Michael used the system lever to raise the control machine's voltage. One second. What's going on? The production line stopped! The control computer's not responding! Oh, you're that punk from the SS Libra! Uh, you're behind this, aren't you? Oh no, what the blazes? The Shadow Pokemon production software's been deleted! Gorgon get, uh, gets furious if things don't go his way. He's going to chew me out again. Did I catch your Shadow Pokemon? Until remains frozen solid. Oh shit! Not quite! we go. Hit yourself? No. Shadow half! Oh, 
Uh oh. Fuck, dude. Again, Arbok fled somewhere. Fucking me. All right. Well, I think we're gonna call the stream here. Yes, we have a boss battle just waiting in there, but we're almost at the two-hour mark anyway. So, uh, I think I'm just gonna call it. So, next time I'll be playing uh, Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness will be, believe it or not, Saturday, 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, assuming all goes well with what I do before these streams. Yes, uh, last, uh, a few days ago, uh, during the Saturday stream, we actually finally, uh, beat, uh, Pokemon Emerald, uh, Leagues beaten, Frontiers beaten, Legendaries caught, uh, Stevens beaten, so... Yeah, we're basically done with uh, with Emerald. The only thing left to do would be the uh, the National Dex, which is a thing I just generally don't do in Pokemon games. So, uh, yeah. Uh, so we're done with Emerald. So Pokemon XD is going to be taking both the uh, the Tuesday and Saturday slots until we beat uh, main game and post game. Or at the very least, we will until uh, around October 10th, which is when uh, Dragon Ball Z uh, Sparking Zero comes out, and I definitely want to stream that. Alright, we can head back to the Purified Chamber for Tangela and whatnot. So when that game comes out, that'll get one of the two slots, and then uh, Sonic X Shadow Generations will probably take priority over... Sparking Zero, since we're probably not going to beat uh, Sparking Zero in the few streams between its release and Sonic X Shadow's release. You know, I'll, I'll make a video explaining it in detail. And that'll go up on my YouTube channel. But for now, uh, Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness on both Tuesdays and Saturdays. At least for the next few weeks. Before I go, um, people in Ukraine could use some help. So, in the about section of my Twitch page, and also in the description of this video, so you're watching on YouTube, there will be links. I'll take you to one or two articles, both of which list various charities sending aid to Ukrainians in need. Um, if you have any spare cash, uh, please consider donating to one or more of the charities listed in another article. People could really use the help. Uh, with all that said, I uh, can't think of anything else I want to say on the subject. So... 
Um, I am going to purify these last few Pokemon that we have in the purify chamber right now. Uh, put more Shadow Pokemon in, and then that will be the stream. Tangle opened the door to a tart. Tangler working the move Solar Beam. Tangler working the move Morning Sun. Tangler obtained a ribbon. Nope. Butterfree opened the door to its heart. Butterfree regained the move Psychic. Butterfree regained the move Morning Sun. Butterfree obtained a ribbon. Nope. Just gonna run around for a little bit. Yeah, we're basically done with uh, this stream, but those two Pokemon are so close to purification, I may as well do this, because if I don't uh, purify on this stream, they're going to uh, finish purification uh, on my way back to the uh, to Gorgon, and I'm going to be very annoyed that I didn't do this. There we go. Beedrill opened the door to its heart. Beedrill are going to move Sludge Bomb. Beedrill are going to move Baton Pass. Beedrill obtained a ribbon. Nope. Shit, I forgot to put that down. Magneton opened the door to its heart. Magneton regained the move Double Edge. Magneton regained the move Refresh. Magneton regained the move Rain Dance. Magneton obtained a ribbon. Nope. Alright, let me put this down real fast. Oh, two. I'm gonna say. Yeah, 50. All right, let's put some new Pokemon in here. It's really just this Weeping Bell. All right, see you guys later with something else.